Imagine having access to over 1,000 powerful AI tools, absolutely free. Tools that can generate stunning images, videos, viral scripts, voiceovers, 3D models, clone your voice, edit photos, create chatbots, and the list goes on. Sounds too good to be true, right? Well, it's not. Today, I'm going to show you exactly how you can access this game-changing platform and use all the tools for free. So, we are going to use Hugging Face. If you've never heard of Hugging Face before, it's basically like the Google of AI models, a massive platform where developers, researchers, and creators share their AI projects. And the best part? Most of these tools are completely free to use. So, let's head over to HuggingFace.co and right here in the top right corner, click on Sign Up. Super simple. Just enter your email, username, and password. Or if you want to speed things up, you can sign in with Google or GitHub. Now, once you hit Create Account, Hugging Face is going to ask you to set up an avatar. You can either upload a photo, choose a random AI-generated icon, or just skip it for now. I'm going to go ahead and do mine real quick and done. All right, so once you're logged into Hugging Face, you'll see an interface like this. It might look a bit overwhelming at first, but... Don't worry, I'll walk you through everything. Now, up here in the top menu bar, click on Spaces. This is where the real magic happens. You'll find thousands of free AI tools covering everything from image generation to AI chatbots, text-to-speech, coding assistance, and more. For now, let's go with image generation, and let's try out this tool called Flux.1 in. All right, so inside Flux.1, you get a simple text box where you can paste your prompt, adjust settings like resolution and aspect ratio, and then generate an image. Now, I already have an AI-generated image that I created in Leonardo AI. So, what I'm going to do is copy that prompt, paste it into Flux.1, and see how the results compare. It's going to take a few seconds to process, and done. Wow, that actually looks really impressive. What do you think? Drop a comment below. Do you think this tool is as good as Leonardo AI? Let me know your thoughts. Okay, let's try another prompt. So, recently, these orange cat videos have been going viral, and I wanted to create something similar. So, I've got a fun orange cat prompt that I'll paste here. By the way, if you guys want a full tutorial on how to create viral orange cat videos, just comment orange cat below, and I'll make a step-by-step -step guide on how to create these and maintain character consistency across multiple images and videos. And here's our final result. Looks pretty cool, but I think we can make it even better by tweaking the prompt and parameters. Let's see what happens when we try these prompts. Tiny astronaut hatching from an egg. Wow, it looks pretty good. Cat, holding a hello world sign. And boom, look at these results. This is exactly why Hugging Face is so powerful. You can test out so many different AI models for free. All right, now let's test out another super popular AI tool, this time one that mimics Midjourney's style. So, if you've been on Instagram or TikTok lately, you've probably seen these tiny worker reels blowing up. People are creating these miniature characters doing everyday tasks, and they're getting millions of views. I actually made a full tutorial on how to create these reels, so if you want to check that out, I've linked it in the description below. All right, so let's generate our own tiny worker concept using this AI tool. I've got a prompt ready. Let's paste it in and see what happens. And boom, here it is. This is really impressive. Look at the details, the lighting, the textures. Hugging Face really has some powerful AI tools. All right, let's have some more fun with this. Let's try another mini workers concept. This time, let's see what happens when we make them cook an omelet. Okay, it's generating. And wow, look at that. It looks great. All right, now that we've tested some insane AI image generators, let's switch things up and explore another powerful category, text-to-speech AI models. Now, most people think of Eleven Labs when it comes to AI voiceovers, but the free options on Hugging Face are actually really impressive too. So let's pick a text-to-speech tool. I'll go with this one. All I have to do is paste my text here and then choose a voice. For this test, let's go with Bella. She's supposed to have a natural, expressive tone. All right, let's hit Generate. A tiny tiger cub, lost and alone, cried in the dark jungle, but he wasn't alone for long. Wow, that sounds really realistic. It actually has a natural flow and doesn't sound too robotic. Now let's try another one. I'm switching the voice to Emma. Let's see how this sounds. A tiny tiger cub, lost and alone, cried in the dark jungle, but he wasn't alone for long. But now, let's check out a male voice. I'm going with George. Let's generate and see how it compares. A tiny tiger cub. Lost and alone, cried in the dark jungle, but he wasn't alone for long. Okay, that's actually really solid. The voice is deep, well-paced, and super usable for content like narration or storytelling. All right, now let's switch things up and try a different AI voice model on Hugging Face. This time, I'm going with Parlor TTS. This one has a slightly different AI voice generation style. Okay, let's generate and see how this one sounds. All the data. 
pre-processing training code and weights are released publicly under a permissive license, enabling the community to build on our work and develop their own powerful models. Sounds good, right? It has a different tone and pacing compared to the previous ones, but it's still really solid for a free AI tool. All right, we've tested some crazy AI tools so far, but Hugging Face has tons of categories. So let's jump into a few more, starting with 3D modeling. So here's a really unique 3D modeling tool that lets you convert 2D images into 3D objects. Let's test it out. I have this perfume image that I used in a previous video demo. So let's upload it and check the remove background option before generating. And our 3D image is ready. Look at that. It took just a few seconds to create a fully rendered 3D object from a flat image. Now, you can download this 3D model and animate it however you like. Super useful for product demos, gaming, or even AR applications. All right, let's try something completely different. Text analysis tools. Hugging Face has AI models that can detect AI-generated content, summarize text, analyze sentiment, and more. So I'm going to copy a chat GPT generated text and paste it here. Let's see if this AI can detect AI generated content. Okay, so it's detected it as 82% fake. I'm assuming that means 82% AI generated, but let me know in the comments below if I'm wrong. And this is what makes Hugging Face so insane. Just look at the endless categories of free AI tools, data visualization, voice cloning, background removal, image upscaling, and the list goes on. All right, let's quickly test an AI powered image upscaler. This one is called Image upscaling playground and I have a cat image that I want to enhance. Let's choose this model X2. Okay, let's hit upscale and see how long it takes. And boom. Whoa, look at the details. The fur, the eyes, everything looks so much sharper. This is crazy good for a free tool. Okay, now let's check out what is probably the most exciting category for most of you. AI video generation. AI generated videos are getting insanely advanced. So let's see how good these free AI models on Hugging Face actually are. First, let's try out this stable video diffusion model. This tool lets you turn a single image into a moving video. So let's upload the same cat image. All right, it's processing. And here's the result. To be honest, I'm not a fan of this one. The motion looks a bit weird and the head movements feel unnatural. But to be fair, you can probably improve the results by tweaking the advanced settings. All right, let's test another AI video model. This time, I'm using Xeroscope. Instead of an image, we'll generate a video from text. A little brown puppy along the riverside. It says 38 seconds remaining, so let's wait. And it's ready. Okay, this one is better, but there's still some weird motion in the background. Let's test a few more prompts. Astronaut riding a horse. Looks cool. Panda eating bamboo on a rock. Okay, now this one looks really good. All right, let's try Flux Animation Creator. This tool creates GIF animations instead of full videos. Let's paste the prompt. Astronaut floating in space. Puppy alongside the riverside. This actually looks way better than the previous models. And there you have it. If you found this helpful, drop a comment with your favorite tool, hit like and subscribe, and check out the links in the description for all the tools we use today. You can try the different tools and comment below which video generation tools work well. Give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more.